Reptiles, a diverse group of creatures with more than 12,000 species, have dominated the Earth for the past 312 million years. Dinosaurs were dominant for 165 million years, but their extinction paved the way for a new group of predators, Sebacidae, terror crocodiles. These reptiles are related to modern crocodiles, but they are not amphibians. Sebacidae are terrestrial predators, once the largest predatory monsters after the reign of dinosaurs. Their story begins with Ogasaurus, a reptile about one meter long that lived during the late Cretaceous period, about 67.7 million years ago. Ogasaurus lived at the same time as Pyraptor and could hunt small animals, even dinosaur eggs. Although surrounded by giant dinosaurs, Ogasaurus or one of its relatives survived the catastrophic meteorite impact, while most dinosaurs became extinct. Their small size and possibly slow metabolism helped them survive this disaster. With the disappearance of dinosaurs, Sebacidae exploded and flourished. After only 500,000 years, they evolved into larger predators, typically Zolmosuchus in the early Paleocene. Zolmosuchus was three times larger than Ogasaurus, becoming the top predator in Bolivia. Meanwhile, in Argentina, a related species, Lorosuchus, also appeared. The golden age of Sebacidae came at the end of the Paleocene with the appearance of Sebacus, the first predatory crocodile to reach a length of 3 meters. Sebacus possesses sharp meat-cutting teeth like a carnivorous dinosaur. It hunted mammals as diverse as notungulates, lithopterans, and even primitive primates. By the Eocene, Sebacidae reached its peak with Baronisuchus, the largest land predator since the age of dinosaurs. This crocodile is up to 10 meters long and weighs more than 1,700 kilograms, hunting giant mammals such as Notungulate and Glyptodont. At the same time, Dantontosuchus, a giant Sebacidae in Europe, also spread terror. Although not as large as Baronisuchus, it was still a fearsome predator, specializing in large ungulates. However, the dominance of Sebacidae in Europe ended 37 million years ago, possibly due to climate change. But in South America, species like Baronisuchus and Langstonia continued to exist. However, the Sebacidae era ended about 11.8 million years ago. The separation of the Amazon River system and the uplift of the Andes radically changed the ecosystem, leading to their extinction. The story of Sebacidae is a testament to the terror crocodile's ability to adapt and survive. From a small creature living in the shadow of the dinosaurs, they rose into terrifying predatory monsters then finally collapsed before the changes of the earth. Thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to click like and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the latest content. Please leave a comment below sharing your opinion.